Hello, everybody. Welcome, and thank you for joining us here today. It's a really exciting day. I'm so excited about our topics. We're talking about 5G, and everyone here is involved in this race to 5G. It's really exciting. Whether we're talking about networks that are 100 times faster or 3 million new jobs, there's something in 5G for everybody. For me, I think that our networks in wireless are going to change more in the next two to three years than they have in the past decade. So think about that. The iPhone was invented 10 years ago, and it changed everything. 5G will change the way we live, work, and play. Education, transportation, smart cities, 5G is only limited by our imagination. And today we're going to hear from those leaders who are making 5G a reality. Back to back, rapid fire, this event was built for millennials. All of the remarks are no longer than 10 minutes. And there's a cocktail party and interactive demos out there, so make sure you see the demos. They're really cool. I'm thrilled that we have the lead technical partners from each of our national carriers and they're racing against each other to be the first and to be the best. Because 5G is a race, and all of you here are part of that race. It's between carriers, between suppliers, between industries, and it's a global race to 5G. Nations have really seen the benefits that we have had to our economy because we won the race to 4G, and they want it for 5G. There's a study that was out this week that said that right now we're in third place in this global 5G race, slightly behind China and South Korea. This is a race we must win, and I'm confident we can win because of the billions of dollars that are being invested and because of the leadership of everyone that you will see on this stage today. Policymakers in DC need to help us win this race. We need hundreds of megahertz more of spectrum, particularly mid-band spectrum. And we need new rules for infrastructure at every level of government. We are in luck. We have the right players around the table, from the administration to the FCC to leaders in Congress. Our four foremost wireless thinkers are here today and they understand the power and the promise of 5G networks. And they know the reforms we need and have them teed up for action.